Hey guys, so I want to do a quick video on uh, RAM usage for CPU bindings. Uh, these three computers up here, they're uh, Omen L25. Uh, I've had them GPU mining for eight, nine months now. They broke even, so I'm just experimenting. Still GPU mining Ethereum. Uh, however, on top, they all have, uh, shoot, they all have uh, Ryzen 5 3500. So they're, they're all mining, uh, CPU mining as well, and a mining Raptorium. So my, uh, I know that the Ghost Rider algorithm fluctuates and it switches a uh, different algorithm so that it deters away ASIC and GPU miners, memory intensive miners. But I never, I did, there was not, uh, nothing definitive on whether or not more RAM uh, would allow it to hash at a higher rate in the long term. So in order to test that out, I'm running uh, 3200 megahertz RAM on all four of them. However, every other one, so remember that this is AMD 1, 2, 3, and 4. On 2 and 4, I'm running two sticks of 8 gigabyte RAM, right? Whereas these ones I'm running two. And as you can see, if you come in, so 1 and 3 are the last one. So you can see right here, that's 8 gigabytes, 4 available, um, three, uh, 4 available and 3.9 is in use right now with very small free amount, only 395 MB. So this is the one, as you can see, and it's running at 50% all the time. So I was wondering if I add another stick of RAM, can I hash higher in the long term because the algorithm fluctuates and uh, it can go up and down. So if you go over here, you're gonna see the other one where I'm running both of the two sticks, right? So let's see, where's my mouse? So you can see two sticks right here and it's only running at 27%. Four uh, gigabyte in use, 12 available, running 27. So I wanted to see in the long term, uh, does this one hash more or not? And I've been running it for two, two days now. So as you can see here, here's the results. Here's the 24, 24 hours results, right? AMD one and three, the one that hashes less. Uh, the average for this one, sorry, the average is uh, 870, 936, and then the one with the two sticks, 934, 931. This one is just out in the corner, there's less cooling, uh, so I think it's just running a bit slower, but as you can see, there's no uh, definitive increase by adding additional RAM, so I'm actually going to take the extra stick out and build other computers with it. Uh, but as you can see, double the RAM, not much, and even the rates, right, in the last, in the last uh, 24 hours, uh, it's hash uh, accepted rates, about 3,000, all of them, and stale, 1711, 1715, zero rejected. So, as the time being right now, it looks like I only need one, uh, one stick. Uh, so if you were wondering if you need more RAM and whether or not it increases, uh, your efficiency in mining not significantly or at all, right? This doesn't uh, indicate that it's doing that. Now you do want to make sure that you have enough available. So uh, whatever you're in use, there's some available left. But whether you have four gigabyte or twelve, it doesn't make a difference. So yeah, uh, hopefully this is helpful for if you guys are looking into uh, RAM and its impact for CPU mining. If you have any questions, drop it down below, guys. Otherwise, please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.